Odor fills the air, trash blowing in the wind, while garbage bags pile up. For Syracuse residents like Isaac Williams, it's been a pain to pick up his own trash and others. I run out of places to put my trash because if it's not picked up, now I have, you know, still creating trash for my house. I run out of space in my trash can, so, you know, where do I put it? And then, you know, animals get into it and it attracts other, you know, animals. City officials say it doesn't have enough mechanics to service its broken down trucks, so trash pickups are often days behind. For Williams, it's not stopping him or his Northeast Syracuse neighbors. We would like to do a cleanup in the Lincoln Hill and Eastwood area. Depending on how much support we get, we could really make an impact when spring cleanup comes. Chief Operating Officer of Syracuse, Corey Driscoll Dunham, says that they are working out solutions to solve the problem. One is looking at rerouting. In terms of the routes, you know, that would certainly help as as we did a, um, which we presented to the council last week, a, a study on our sanitation operation. We found that the routes are completely uneven, um, mm -hmm. that some of the um, some of the trucks are picking up way more tonnage than other trucks, and that's just not an efficient use of our resources. In the meantime, Williams and his neighbors are now meeting every Friday to discuss a spring cleanup. Coming from the community to help, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a service, but it's one we're happy to provide, and it's for completely free. <laughs>